there's a lot of really interesting things that are going on conversations around the core infrastructure and kind of how we build proofs. This event is being hosted with Google Cloud and it's really interesting to see Web2 cloud providers in the space pay attention to verifiable computations. Abhi and I used to be on a lot of calls when we were working with few ZK customers and once on a call we were like, hey, we're talking to a lot of people together. Maybe we just bring all of them in one place. I've been a researcher and been to many research conferences where we talk about this topic of zero knowledge and succinct proofs and you don't get the feedback and the similar type of talks from industry practitioners. It's been really good, really productive. Seen a lot of very smart people talk about their trades. There have been a lot of talks about ZK EVMs and ZK rollups. Big groups are making software development kits for everyday devs to run their own ZK rollup. What I'm excited about is to actually see it happen. We came to the Google ZK Summit because we've been working heavily on a variety of ZK technology for the past many years. We thought this would be a good place to come and kind of both share that research and be able to talk to people that are going through some of the same growing pain that we are in terms of understanding how to uh, improve our technology and honestly kind of build community around it. If you look at the ZK scaling roadmap for Ethereum, it's always been about making that proving infrastructure better so that actually we can hit the scalability goals that we're all planning. We're just excited to see the proofs get faster and see the proofs get cheaper because <laughs> running ZK proofs right now is really, really expensive. We're quite keen to increase the security for our users. You know, our current system is secure, but it's always nice to go from a nine to a 10 if possible. The discussions that were most interesting to me were the ones around real world use cases and applications. So we talked yesterday about utilizing ZK for privacy, which I think it was one of the first characteristics that people got excited about zero knowledge for. The whole trade in ZK applications will lead to bigger and bigger proofs, which means bottlenecks and being able to deliver performance, both at a decent cost and in a reasonable time. I'm starting to see that in the business community. There's some really strong work, especially in some of the public accounting firms and their consulting practice on use of ZK in enterprises. We saw an opportunity for Google to bring the community together and have discussions on various aspects, be it infrastructure, where cloud plays a role, or be it from a core labs perspective as well. But I think the real value of this was having these two audiences share ideas and share their performance numbers and share what they're planning to do. I think that's very important for a community. We hope that this can be a catalyst for the community to come together and push the innovation and ZK forward.